We're live at SandusskyRegister.com, Sandusky Register's Facebook page. We're at what is kind of an epicenter. There's a, a relatively small group of protesters in front of me. We're right at Indiana Avenue and 3rd Street, Washington, D.C. On that side are the viewing areas for the swearing-in of Donald J. Trump, which is expected to take place in just a few minutes, I believe. Uh, the protest has, has been mostly peaceful. We haven't seen any problems at all. There was one point when marchers were coming this way and police formed their own wall uh, to allow people with tickets to get to that side, which is closer to the viewing area. There's nothing unusual about having to have tickets to be on that side. What is unusual, perhaps, is the level of protest right here. Uh, but there's always protests at every inauguration. These are not coronations, they're inaugurations. of a duly elected president uh, in the United States of America, this is how it works. Uh, people with voices speaking out uh, with their protests. Th these protesters here, their intention was to form a wall and not let others go to the other side. I think the real intention was to let them know that this is the kind of wall you want to build, perhaps. We've been here since about 9 o'clock this morning, and it has been mostly peaceful. This is this is either the quiet before the storm, or it's the, the day before the storm. A giant uh, rally is planned tomorrow. The women's protest movement on the mall, uh, protesting the presidency of Donald J. Trump. He will be sworn in tomorrow, uh, or today, in just a few minutes, on the Capitol steps. Uh, with the National Mall as the viewing area. That area is for ticketed, ticketed uh, people. We're here some, uh, some, uh, let's walk over this way if we could. So there's a little bit more of a chant happening now. The protesters are locking arms and as a sign of solidarity. solidarity. The 45th president of the United States is being sworn in at noon today on that side of this wall of human beings. Protesters gathered here locking arms as a, a metaphor, perhaps, for what a wall is. They, they wanted people with tickets to know that they weren't uh, walled out from Donald Trump. Uh, it was their protest. It's been peaceful all day. Uh, very little clashes. Uh, police have been Johnny on the spot every time something pops up. Uh, mostly, 
People are just expressing their First Amendment rights, uh, both uh, pro-Trump and protesting against Trump. We're live at the right outside the National Mall in Washington, D.C. This is the Sandusky Register mobile team. I'm Matt Westerholt, managing editor of the Register, and I'm with my daughter, Kylie Ruth Westerholt. I'm losing my voice because I've been uh, talking rather loudly as my producer here has been insisting that I do. Uh, we're going to be here all day today, and we're also covering the women's protest on the Capitol below. minutes ago, uh, the wall, the protesters attempted to uh, not allow people with tickets to get to the other side, but ultimately police uh, put the kibosh on that pretty quickly. Sorry. Everybody's been very uh, open, very friendly, talking about why they're here, why they're protesting. We've talked to people from all over the country, Santa Cruz, California, Florida, Missouri. We talked to a combat veteran, a Vietnam veteran. From Missouri who told us he was protesting because cyber war is an act of war and his his claim was similar to uh, John Lewis's claim that this is an illegitimate president Donald J Trump is being sworn in as the 45th president of the United States right about now on that side of this wall of people this wall of protesters protesters do seem to be losing a little steam uh, Mr. Trump is being sworn in right now. It's 12.02 p.m. He was set to take the oath of office at noon. So it will be a feta complete in just a few minutes. President Donald J. Trump will take over leadership of the free world. Uh, these protesters have made it very clear uh, in different ways why they're here. Uh, we'll be here live all day today. And tomorrow, My I'm sorry. My phone is waterproof, so it's fine. Okay, we're going to take a break right now. Okay. Check back here later for updates at SandustyRegister.com. <laughs> 